Hi guys, welcome to another video here from the SJB Review YouTube channel. Okay, so today's video is a bit of a last minute one and a bit of a shock to the system. Um, I'm very, uns um, very unpredicted. Basically, Merlin have today announced that the VIP pass has been discontinued um, due to their reviewing of the pass. Um, every year they review their products and this year um, they decided to discontinue the pass. Um, based on their reviews. Last year we were given a um or two years ago we were given a survey about how the pass can improve etc etc and if it was going to be um available and if it was going to be discontinued etc um and if we buy premium so obviously they've looked over their results and obviously all the years and stuff. Um and yeah unfortunately they've decided to discontinue the pass but the video is not to rant on about that, it's to celebrate the use of the pass and what we managed to do in the past five years of being a Mono VIP pass. Learning VIP pass, annual pass holder. Does that make sense? Um, basically, I was a year one pass holder when it first launched. Um, it's been out for five years now. Um, so every year it's been, uh, it's been benefits added, been benefits removed, uh, gone tickets added and stuff like that. So it's been up and down. But so, start of the uh, start of it, it was five hundred pound introductory offer, which was fantastic, uh, really. And yeah, so we brought that and. Through the VIP pass in just the first year, we did make a lot of friends and a lot of connections. Um, you know, there's it's been so many good things over the years, but since the first year, when new things got added in the second or third year, and this turned out to be a fantastic journey. Um, so I'm not going to go through year by year, but I'm just going to give you the highlights of what the pass really did for the channel and for myself and everything. But um, <clears throat> so apart from that, I just want to give a few men uh, special mentions to everyone. So a massive thank you to uh, Deb Moore, who uh, created the Merlin VIP pass holder uh, Facebook group when it first got introduced. Also, they got a VIP one um, and they've also got a Merlin annual pass uh, pass holders one which is for the standard premium pass holders uh, which has 40, 44,000 members right now which is doing great which is great news but obviously when the pass first launched you know it was a very solo kind of tr adventure because you know a lot of it was a lot of money for people and if you're buying it just for yourself uh, as a theme park enthusiast or just like bird attractions in general then it was like who do you go with if you haven't got a family so uh, it was just me but thanks to Deb creating that group um I was able to meet so so many people, and I tell you what, it's just been since then. It's just been absolutely remarkable. Um, I will mention a massive thanks to also Denmore, and then through uh, to Nicole as well. Nicole uh, was brilliant. It's been brilliant since the first start the first year. We joined. Uh, we met for. Uh, they did some science stuff as well at Four Park. We did that together at the half term, and just did loads of trips. Um, so yeah, and also a massive thanks to Annie and Avatar, um, uh, for for joining us on our adventures as well uh, and thanks to them um we were able to do Orton Towers for the first time which was a few years back um so that's fantastic and so yeah so from first year you know I would never have met Nicole if it wasn't for that parcel group which Deadmore created so again massive thank you to that and really what what would you know what would have made you out of the past so that's fantastic and um, second year round we did uh, obviously liam joined onto the pass and we started doing a lot more trips um we, we hit out four parks a four park like non-stop um but unfortunately due to also times going on four park has changed its market and its offerings um so when we first started there we also met a lot of memory a lot of lovely members of staff uh, like david and stuff like that so massive shout out to david you're you're awesome we miss you um in the vip pass unit um you you know there's so many offerings from coastal clients behind the sea tours um uh, and also throw nights oh i don't think you're actually our talk up a top of nemesis uh david if you're watching this um where we talked about front for like just two hours of the face it alone which was awesome obviously face it alone got discontinued as well as um the, the uh park was focusing more on other things but yeah so we managed to do uh lots of behind the tours coastal clients we've done all three of them as well there on the channel we did cameron obviously this is going back years uh cameron was saw alive Big Top and Platform 15 behind the tours. Obviously, all the same. Big Top does change every year, um, which is great. So uh, that's always something new. And then, obviously, as years gone on, we've done um, Scarefest and stuff like that with the pass and um, <clears throat> stay overnight at uh, the uh, Splash Land. So we did Water Park. Water Park was free for us again. And uh, Scarefest, brilliant time. Obviously, you've got to pay for the tickets usually as full park made so free. We got them free as well uh, for every day we went. So we did... Uh, uh, Subterra, Nemesis Subterra, and 
and I'll send them as a sub to her. Cut that one out. We did all the mazes there, basically. Um, <clears throat> I think, I'm not sure what it is. It might be Nemesis Subter. No, but I thought that was the ride. Basically, the one where you go, where you get pulled in backwards and you're by yourself and you have to work your way out. Can't remember what it's called. So forgive me for that, War Towers fans. <laughs> You'll know what it's called. Um, so, yeah, we did all that and you usually have to pay for them. So, again, uh, you know, it's it's made its work. You, have, you do get your money out of this pass. But also, the price did increase every year from 500 to 600 to 65 to 75 for brand new passes. And the, the wait list. It's been phenomenal. Um, it's crazy that so many people have been on the waitlist and wanted this pass. Unfortunately, uh, with the main money, I've decided to won't be going to be discontinued. But hey ho, never mind. It's on on to better things. <clears throat> um, but just want to highlight a few things. So obviously, uh, Mass Effect Deb obviously for credit group and Alan and Avatar for year one of the pass. Uh, Nicole since since the start, you've been fantastic. Meeting up for different trips and adventures, and. Also, Liam for joining me for almost every other adventure since then, for years and years. Uh, we've been doing trips together, and this VIP pass has made it so incredible great. And so, yeah, just so th this is just a massive thank you to Marlin as well. So, basically, I'll say this is what the pass did like. This, so, yeah, this channel has been based uh, on the, I'll say it's been really been based on the VIP pass and its offerings because every other channel out there. If it be uh, the big channels like Feedback Worldwide or um, smaller channels, it's, you know, every little channel is doing vlogs. And this one, we've kind of steered away from vlogs recently, or over the last couple of years, and me focusing on the VIP experiences, which have come with this uh, fantastic pass. <laughs> and so, I'll say vlogs, you know, in the market of YouTube, but it's something I really enjoy doing, and I'll continue to do it. But it's finding a break in that market of what we can bring to the, you know, to the two viewers which are actually going to be something unique and um something actually people want to watch not just repeat of oh we're doing a vlog for park day or this day and that day because you're not actually allowed to record on the ride so it is just we're going to go to Fort park we're going to do samurai now we're going to do nemesis we're going to do stealth i just cut 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 so i wasn't really enjoying doing that because we have no ride footage for you guys um so moving on from that we did obviously coastal clients behind two tours um coastal clients behind two tours on some of the right uh, on on, on the mazes we were going to do the rise but they got discontinued unfortunately but uh, like i'm saying so yeah it's been really based on um the vip experiences so we've done pretty much all the golden tickets on that website if you go to merlin uh, and you'll pass to code uk for slash golden uh, vip and then click on the golden ticket uh, page you'll bring, see a list of things which we've done uh if it if it be uh rita um dungeon lates sea life feeding uh, work class and behind the tours we've done pretty much all of it and it's been fantastic that we've been able to do it so much um over the last couple of years obviously not all of it's been used for gold tickets some of it's been paid for but um it's been nice to just get like like sea trek at manchester that would have cost 50 pound but we did it with a gold ticket which was fantastic i wouldn't you know if i didn't have this pass i wouldn't like i won't do that but because it was there and as an offering it was a unique experience for me to do i'll say i could record that but it was great um so yeah so that's fantastic and yeah so what can i say these tickets have been amazing and it's been able i've been able to record some of it and bring to you guys so some of the stuff you've enjoyed well the most popular video on the channel most liked video is obviously the retail behind scene tours unfortunately uh full park no all towns haven't done anymore uh gone on tickets since then uh, they did have the um high rates which we've done that's on the channel and they did um one of the sea life but we didn't get around to doing that but uh, if you go to the sjbb.co.uk website and or sjbb.co.uk forward slash gold uh, gt it'll take you to the golden ticket page because i've got a dedicated video hp hub and you can find all our coastal clients a shark feed from legoland before they got discontinued um behind the tours of sea life behind the tours of rise uh enemy dungeons is on there and even if we haven't been able to video it uh we did have we have taken pictures from these different events such as the york dungeons weren't able to, weren't allowed to record but we did take photos so that's in the photo gallery on there as well so again that's just a bonus we wouldn't really be bothered about it but this part really did introduce me to a, a wide selection of attractions not just merlin you know not just a theme parks work castle who thought we would ever go to work castle like what are we going to do there it turned out to be one of my favourite places to go be, especially at Halloween time. And the shows they put on and the sales we got for free as well. And the the fire chest in it's just a really cool environment for the Halloween season away from, you know, your typical um scare maze and stuff. Also they do scare maze as well, like House of Wax, it's 
it's, it's incredible, honestly. And it's I've been able to take you across the journey through either of your vlogs, uh, experiences, or see anybody you loved, really you loved. Um, so I'm a shark fiend at Legoland was, um, I got quite a lot of views and uh, coastal lines and some of the privacy tours. And also we did the face at loads ceremony, that's great. The actors really on, uh, really involved in that heavily, so that's brilliant. That was the, uh, also we don't see what goes on behind closed doors, so we don't know what the staff and all you know the cast think of the videos, but I tell you. You you make some really cool memories. Hang on, let me just get this like. <sighs> Sorry, I'm back. So yeah, I really like collecting these like seal blocks and putting the memories in it. So that was from Scarbados, which is a sea life at Scarborough. I'll say the water block. We've got another one for that for um, Pirate Falls. The snow block. This is from Sea Life Paris. Again, that we've got free entry to um, a broad attractions as well. I wish I made more use out of that really, but again. Much and all. Um, so we've like, we got free entry to Sea Life Paris. Okay, we didn't figure who, why would we do everything on Sea Life? Because they gave us a reason to, and everything you got there, like you got extras, like free guidebooks and behind the stores, and also just to make use of the garden tickets, it was fantastic. Like the penguin feed we've done, turtle feed, ma uh, shark feed, ray feed, absolutely phenomenal. Um, the bat one, I need to put a feeling in that, and then also, so yeah, going back to um, the face it alone, so like, that was us for um. That's, it's meant to be a red block, but because of the, water, the sun's got to it, it's gone kind of yellowish. Uh, that's our photo from Saw Alive uh, on the face it alone. Again, fantastic. So they don't do it anymore. But if you don't have got the opportunity to do it, you missed out. But yeah, it's, with this part, it's just been so much good. So obviously, <clears throat> going, I've been, obviously with the channel, I've been dedicated to that. We've stayed away from vlogs and more concentrated on VIP experiences and stuff like that. But um, obviously with the pass itself, um that's what it looks like he is he will see um if you go back a couple of years i did make a guide on it um a more in detail and in-depth guide which is on available on the website go to sgb.co.uk for such vip it's on there um we got we get three pin badges every year of our set obviously no one likes that one because that's not burning brand it's just a typical vip um if, there's all the pin badges on there but i've got the camera steady so i won't touch that um we get our photos as well we've got our Golden tickets and yeah, so but two of them still to use for this year, which is fantastic. And uh, bring a friend. Obviously, this is when it first started. It, um, used to just get people in, but with the feedback given from the team, we that now gets you into the park and also gets you a bit fast track for the day. Again, how much value is that? That's like hundred fifty pound value for one tower, or so, well, you know. Because it's like you've gone on the gate, like 50 quid on the gate, and the ninety pounds of fast track all day. I got two of them. Brilliant. Again, I don't really use them that much, but they are, I'll make sure I use them before my pass expires. And so, yeah, um, at the end of the year, we're going to Florida, obviously. So we're going to be doing Legoland Florida there with the pass because we get free entry. Um, unfortunately, we won't be doing the Orlando wide because it's been taken over by Icon, but we'll be doing Orlando, Sea Life Orlando, and Manitou's as well. But yeah, so also, again, another thank you to Merlin that, you know, they, they didn't have to give these extra offers, but every time we go to um, uh, one of the attractions, we get, like, um, a guidebook for, like, Sea Lives, Warwick Castle book, free, Dungeon, York Dungeon book, free, London Eye, London Dungeon book, Man of Two Swords. Again, yeah, these are all free extras. Again, I wouldn't usually buy them, don't get me wrong. Um, because I know I haven't read any of them, but it's just for safekeeping and hate the sake of it. And every time we go to attraction as well, we usually get free photos. So that's from the Blackpool Tower Dungeons. There, we've got, we've got tons and tons of this. It's only some, it's only some of the stuff I took out of uh, storage. Obviously, the Shrek book as well. Oh, we've got that free as well. Not sure we're meant to get that free, but um. Star can't remember, kind of gave it to us anyway, so thank you for that. <laughs> you're getting hit and miss when you when you go with the staff and um, if you get it free or not, but oh. Aha, me being an ogre. But yeah. What can I say? It's been a bit of a letdown that they get rid of the past, but you know, without that, I'll be, we won't have been able to do all these sea lives, these dungeons, and all these unique experiences. Even like the Birmingham thing we did in in um, last month. Again, we would never have done that. We've done diving. For goodness sake, we've done diving. Well, 
awesome experience that is. Again, it's usually 180 quid, don't get me wrong, but we will see with a VIP pass, so we get half price, which is the only reason why we did it, because otherwise we wouldn't pay that much money. And here we did dive in high rates we couldn't do because it was um, obviously too windy. Um, I fly, something I would have done anyway. Uh, bit of a letdown to be fair. Um, <clears throat> again, that, was, that would have been 50 quid. And we got that half price all included in one, uh, all, all in event show. Go check out the vlog from that. It's all got the videos in all together. But yeah, wow. Uh, Blackpool, uh, we did um, done all the Gantes of Blackpool, which is champagne, uh, shark feeding, um, and... Uh, uh, Blackpool Tower Circus. Um, we've done the Royal Box two times and doing it again in a oh, couple of weeks. <sighs> what can I say? So, yeah. In terms of VIP, it's going to be missed. Don't get me wrong, but I've met so many friends and done so many cool adventures. And we've done a really good thing as a community. And I really hope that you've enjoyed the content I've been able to bring to you as a VIP pass holder um, to obviously people that w wanted to do it but um, couldn't afford it or people that are just interested in the past in general or people that wanted to buy a pass all in all i'm glad you've been able to enjoy the content i've been taking up for you fortunately um as you know the gold tickets offerings have been very limited over the last couple of years so none of them not many new ones come out but it's been an honor to be able to embark on all these adventures and bring this content to you and yeah whatever the future holds we'll be getting a premium pass uh, but obviously the vip experiences will be very very limited from now on due to obviously as a man of VIP pass holder <laughs> that's how I mostly got all the content I'll see there's a huge price to pay for one year but we've got a limited fast track for Azure uh, Friday nights uh, we've got free entry to the uh, towers uh, mazes and stuff like that and god all the all the animal camps we've done we, we've I've had a snake um, we've done ray feed capybara feed um, penguin feeding uh, even we've got a stroke to penguin at Scarborough, go and check that one out. It's a, it's a marine biologist video for the day. I just recently went live. Um, we've met an owl, sharks, so many things at the top of my head. Again, go to the SGB KDK website and go to uh, the Gone Tickets or the Sea Life section and or, just check it out. It's got a wide selection of content. Something I've always done is done. I've done obviously the solo adventure every year to Paris. I've done vlogs, uh, VIP experiences, behind the scenes tours, guides, arcade videos. And lots and lots more. I like to have variety on the channel rather than just doing vlogs from certain theme parks. I like to do everything I want. That's why, yeah, that's why it's been such a great couple of years because I'm doing things I love and this VIP pass just opened up my eyes to and opened up my opportunity to do things I thought I'd never do. So again, massive thanks to Merlin Entertainments for bringing out the pass and all of you guys and all the all the, all the friends I met and for the trips and especially Liam. Um, Liam's fantastic and um, um, Nicole as well and all, all old and new friends I've met over the years and even some of also um, I even met uh, even starting a couple of videos with Sean and um, <clears throat> some of the people from Moist TV like Ruby and stuff we met up with before so it's been a couple of years of madness but one more year left of the past until it runs out in October then downgrade to premium and we'll just see how that goes but plenty more things to come we've got blackpool uh, in a couple of weeks time we've got uh, manchester we're doing um another adults nights we're still arranging that to be fair and we've got the legland no we've got uh, orlando 2019 the adventure continues we'll be doing so much more stuff than we did in 2016 uh things like discovery cove legland uh florida and um vip experiences for that as well which is additional paid for Okay, so thanks very much, and uh, I'm sorry for being ramble on, but this is just a really dedication video to what this past able to do for me, my part, uh, for the channel. And yeah, so thanks for watching, guys, and uh, I'll see you in the next adventure.